ENT here. Happy Christmas and happy holidays to everyone. This is my Christmas present. It clearly says from Santa. It's a joke. Anyway, let's open this package and let's find out what I have added to my collection. Very careful, as always, very careful using knives. Okay, very well packed. Let's see from where I can. Okay. Be very careful using knives not to hurt yourself, not to damage anything inside. Okay, I think it's open. Piece of tape here. Okay, let's find out what we have. Very, very well packed. Very, very well packed. And there it is. Let's take it out. Extremely well packed. Let's remove everything. Let's remove everything. And here it's my Christmas present. A sealed box of prophecy. So, why prophecy? There isn't any particular reason. No upcoming set with synergies or a spike in value of singles. The most expensive card is still Rhystic Study, which will continue to see more and more reprints. The only reason I bought this box is because these boxes are starting to climb up in price and don't want to lose an opportunity. Take a look on eBay, TCG Player, Card Market and check the prices of these boxes. They are not cheap and they will never be cheap again. Another reason is that I believe these sets, the so-called post-reserve list sets, Mercator Musk, Nemesis, Prophecy, Till Judgment are extremely underappreciated and more importantly I believe there are less sealed boxes than everyone thinks. Just go and take a look on eBay, TCG Player, Card Market and tell me how many boxes in English sealed in good condition at a decent price you can find. Lucky if you can find 10 boxes. Leave me a comment below what do you think about Prophecy as a sealed booster box or as a set. Here's the section button, subscribe for my channel for more and more interesting videos about Magic the Gathering and the collectible web.